Okay, so today we are going to be cleaning our throttle body. You are going to need to take off the intake. So, um, there is a link. If you have the stock intake on your Mitsubishi Eclipse, then um, I will link the video in the description just to let you know how to take it off first. I want to let you guys know that you really don't have to take off the throttle body to clean it. I was just doing that to get a more thorough clean. You also want to wait until it's completely dry before you put it back together or start the car. So the bolts you're going to be taking off are going to be 12 millimeter. There's going to be five of them. I would definitely recommend a ratchet, not a wrench because um, because these bolts are extremely long. You're going to be doing it for a long time. They poke out so it's easier to use the ratchet. So there's the throttle body. I have to take that off. Um, I have to take these two bolts right here off and then there's another 12 millimeters right here. These are all 12 millimeters. So after you take those four bolts off, you are going to have to take this last one and that's going to let you take off the throttle body right here. And don't lose this gasket. There is this tiny gasket that we are going to have to take out. That black sensor that you can see underneath the throttle body, I'm pretty sure is the idle air control motor connector. And you're going to have to take that off just to make it a little bit easier. I didn't take off the throttle position sensor because that one was a little tricky. You take off these hoses, this one right here, and um, this one. Okay, so taking these hoses off um, from right there is a pain in the ass. So I recommend doing that first. I have to take off that one too. Okay, so how I got those um, hoses off is by using WD-40 and little nose pliers. You're going to want to spray the throttle cleaner in there. You see all that gunk and build up um, and clean it out with a paper towel so I cleaned it as much as possible that is just like I don't know that won't really come off but um yes yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and put it back together so I'm gonna put it into position first okay and then I'm gonna start with this bowl right here don't forget the gasket you want to clean this also um, and then it'll slip right into there again so then you go ahead and put everything back together, these bolts, and then this as well, all of these. And um, then you put your intake back on and everything will be perfect. Everything will be a lot cleaner, a lot smoother. Don't forget to put your hoses back on. Um, the one thing I do recommend is to make sure that these are facing you. These are facing you, so when you need to take it off again or want to mess with your car again, it'll be a lot easier than it was. Um, and if these were already facing your way, then you were very lucky because mine weren't. And it was extremely hard to take them off, so um, good luck, guys. And be safe. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on how to fix your Mitsubishi Eclipse.